Okay. So, anyways, um, and then I like to package mine back in a sealed Ziploc baggie. They come in two strips. One strip will take care of both of your hands, and then I usually just go like this because you know what they are still. See that? And then you can just put them back in there a lot easier than trying to feed them in as a big strip. But you do it the way you want to do it. And then I will tape that off. And then I pick my nails, which I already kind of have an idea. This will be my thumb. Um, this will be my pointer. Thumbs last. Just a reminder. Thumbs last. Um, I'll probably do that as my middle finger. No. Not my middle, my next middle. Yeah, I'll do this guy. Alright. Fine, middle. That guy. And then I know that one. So, that being said, aren't they just lovely? This is um, part of the fun, is coming up with a game plan here. Which ones you want to do on what finger? I just like this too, because you get kind of, you know, a salon look at home. Cheap. If you don't like it, you always take it back off and you're not going to hurt anybody's feelings. So you take up your top coat. Go ahead and peel your nail off like so, if I can. Alright. Keep your little tab. Take that puppy off if you want to. And then, oh, whoa. Likes my finger. Right down the middle, people. Alright. Where I'm putting that? Probably not. Okay. There. Okay. So this is my thumb. I'm going to center it up as much as I can. And then I'm going to stretch this one because I already know this is a short nail. There we go. Oh, cuss word. I just did my thumb first again. I lied. Don't do your thumb first. Cuss word. I just said cuss word, sorry. Okay, don't do your num thumb first because you gotta do that. I always forget. I'm gonna start making myself a note and putting it on my forehead. You wanna do your other fingers first, so let's go to the pointer. Alright, get rid of this guy. See, you need your thumb now, except I don't really have them anyways. As busy as I am, I'm constantly breaking my nails off. At least they look pretty. So I definitely got the oils off my fingers because these suckers are sticking to my finger. I'm going to do about halfway. Put this back on the plastic. Let's go here on your finger. Oh, cuss word. It's stuck to my finger. This is interesting. These are some good ones. Stretch it a little. See if I can get it to cover my nail since I just mutilated it. roll it over the end and then I'll come back and pick that off now you're gonna do the one across the street because you want to use these so they don't dry out so take this you're gonna come over here to the other pointer you're gonna take it up to your edge get down on this so you do this end down the middle then down the sides and then you're gonna If you can see it because I'm not watching in the viewfinder, I'm watching my actual finger. Okay, there. So you just peel that little sucker right off. These are some awesome ones. There we go. This is actual nail polish, so if you get it on the floor and you don't sweep it up or get it before, it will stick to your floor. Just like nail polish. You can see right there, I did get that little edge. So 
I'm not going to worry about it because there's enough going on on this nail. You're not really going to see it unless you're like a nail expert. Nail police. Just get it out from under there. Alright, go to this guy. This is my middle finger. My Tolman. Remember, it's left, right, left, right, or right, left, right, left, whatever hand you are. Um, just try to put it down the middle. Put it back on your tab. I did wash my hands too right before I did this, so okay, so we're gonna go here and there. I don't like that this is a little small, so I'm gonna stretch it. There we go. If you feel like you need to clip your nails, clip your nails when you're done applying your nail strips because that way if you pull it too short at least you don't cut your nail so yes I'm truly 47 sad but true isn't this boring oh I forgot guy across the street gotta get on my game here people I'm going to be a movie star I've got to know my parts it's a little short, I don't like that. So you can either take it back off and hope that you don't rip it. Back on, there we go. There we go. And then these little suckers like so. Get on, get out. How many fingers do I have? There we go. I thought I got five. Yep. If you get long, luxurious, beautiful nails, enjoy them. Because some of us stubbles cannot grow nails. It's probably just because I sanitize and wash my hands so frequently. And if you get like this and you're used to doing it, you don't even have to put it back on the plastic. You can just keep it on your finger. Is what I just did. Are you getting this? I think we should get comment. Like, oh my gosh, Kathy Bolin, you're so boring. Mm -hmm. And then when these are all set, I will go back. And get my edges. And that is why you keep your thumbs naked until you're all the way done. Because your thumbs are the ones that you use to score your nails. And I forgot. Alright, one more. Let me see. And if you don't, then what happens is you're using your colored nail and you bend it back. See how I bent that back? You just don't have a very good nail edge to score with. You can still do it. Just you have to make sure you put your nail down. Push it back down. These are some good sticky suckers. No, that was. And these will come off with hand washing um, off your skin after a couple hand washings. But of course, you want to just get it off when you can, it's just easier.
This is my disgusting puny nail. I broke it a couple weeks ago. Or, um, I don't even know anymore. Every day, every day runs together for me. But it was quite short. I split it right down the middle. Okay. There is eight out of... No, I lied. Seven out of ten. All right. Now I'm going to do my pinky. My pinky nail is a little bit wider on the end. So I'm probably going to have to stretch this one a little bit. Normally I would trim it, but because it's got the little stars on it, you would see my trim job. So I'm just going to probably stretch it when I put it on, if I can. Stretch my edge here just a little. Gentle stretch, gentle stretch. And I stretched it from side to side on that one. There we go. See how exciting my life is? Don't be hating on me, people. This is a full set at one sitting that you're seeing here. That's why it's taking 15 years of your life you'll never get back. And if you're real meticulous, you would, you'll get all this where you want it to be. All right, so here's my other pinky. And doesn't it figure my thing flipped over? And so it's stuck. Hold on. I don't go down without a fight. Hold on. Come on. See, you got to make sure you put it on the slippery side. See that? I just did not do that. So what does that mean? It's sticking to the paper. That one's gone. That's right. I'll get another one out. Who knows? This might be just all red. Who knows? With me, it's, it's a surprise. This one I've been waiting. These fresh, these fresh little suckers right out of the package, they are really great to work with because they're flexible, they're, um, they're sticky, they're really cool. So always make sure you put them back in the package and seal them up, whatever ones you're not using, because otherwise they will, they will cure, because that's what they're supposed to do, and then you won't get them. Okay, so I'm going to get one of these. Let's use this other one. I have to stretch it real good, but that's all right. Let's use this end. We'll see. I do not have Barbie fingers, that's for sure. I have Barbie nothing. sticky side on the slippery side all right now hopefully I can get this guy stretched good enough 